Welcome to this video on thermal equilibrium. In this video, we are exploring the concept of thermal equilibrium and how it works using a simple experiment. We take two bodies of the same mass, one at 100 degrees Celsius and the other at 0 degrees Celsius and connect them. We will then plot the graph to show the heat loss and gain by the bodies. Finally, we will change the mass ratio to 6 ratio 4 and then 4 ratio 6 and plot the graph of heat loss and gain. Let's begin the experiment by taking two metal blocks of the same mass. One block is heated to 100 degrees Celsius and the other block is kept at 0 degrees Celsius. We will then connect the two blocks together and let them come to thermal equilibrium. As the blocks are connected, we can see that the hot block loses heat while the cold block gains heat. This heat transfer takes place until the two blocks reach the same temperature. The graph shows a steady decline in the temperature of the hot block and a steady increase in the temperature of the cold block until both blocks reach the same temperature, which is the point of thermal equilibrium. Changing the mass ratio. Now, let's change the mass ratio of the blocks to 6 ratio 4. We will repeat the experiment by taking a block of 6 units and heating it to 100 degrees Celsius, and another block of 4 units and keeping it at 0 degrees Celsius. We will connect the two blocks and observe the heat transfer until thermal equilibrium is reached. Graph of heat loss and gain. As the blocks are connected, we can see that the hot block loses heat while the cold block gains heat. However, due to the difference in mass, the rate of heat transfer is different. The graph shows a slower decline in the temperature of the hot block and a slower increase in the temperature of the cold block until both blocks reach the same temperature, which is the point of thermal equilibrium. Now, let's change the mass ratio to 4 ratio 6. We repeat the experiment by taking a block of 4 units and heating it to 100 degrees Celsius, and another block of 6 units and keeping it at 0 degrees Celsius. We will connect the two blocks and observe the heat transfer until thermal equilibrium is reached. Graph of heat loss and gain. The graph to show the heat loss and gain by the blocks during the process of thermal equilibrium. As the blocks are connected, we can see that the hot block loses heat while the cold block gains heat. However, due to the difference in mass, the rate of heat transfer is different. The graph shows a faster decline in the temperature of the hot block and a faster increase in temperature of the cold block. 